Courtney Hansen here with you at NASCAR.com. If you can't make it to the racetrack to see your favorite drivers in person, there is no better way to experience the excitement of NASCAR than by tuning in to the TV broadcast. But have you ever thought about what it takes to bring all of that nail-biting action into your living room? Every week, an army of trucks and trailers full of high-tech equipment rolls into the track and blossoms into the NASCAR TV compound. Staffed by hundreds of skilled and dedicated professionals, the TV compound is one of the most sophisticated parts of a race weekend and involves layers of technology. Big effort getting out on a Sunday night, getting to the next town. There's probably 500 people a week that come to the compound between NASCAR people, productions, the networks, ESPN, Speed, Fox, whoever. Everybody shares the compound. They share a lot of common resources, security guards, catering, robotics, the fiber, internet connectivity come in that we all shared it just to build that weekend office. In NASCAR's early days, races were broadcast in shortened versions, sometimes days after the actual event. Leroy Alver wins the Southern 500 and his crew goes wild. Live from Daytona Beach, Florida, a CBS Sports Special. CBS was the first to broadcast live flag-to-flag -flag coverage of a NASCAR race, beginning with the 1979 Daytona 500, one of the most memorable races in the sports history. Donnie Allison in first. Where will Cale make his move? He comes to the inside. Donnie Allison throws the block. Cale hits him. Today, nearly every minute of practice and qualifying and every race are broadcast live by one of NASCAR's many broadcast partners. Beyond airing the race, the TV compound provides an important element of support to NASCAR's competition staff. A state-of-the-art replay system allows NASCAR race control to review 18 camera angles side by side in real time. In addition to the replay system, each car is fitted with a transponder that lets NASCAR know where each car is running at any given moment during the race. And we're so proud of all the technology that our broadcast partners have helped us with and our IT group uh, to be able to electronically, uh, without any human error attached to it, uh, uh, regulate the sport like pit road speed and other elements. So we can record any feed, any audio, any data. We send all of that up to race control via fiber networks that we've laid out at the track every week. The quality of the clarity of the broadcast product, when you translate that into the control tower and you can slow things down, you can, you can hone in on details, uh, it's remarkable. With these innovations, NASCAR is able to make the right calls on the track and keep the racing fair for the teams and thrilling for the fans. The TV compound is a massive operation. It's made up of nearly 40 trailers and responsible for running almost 50 miles of cable around the track each week. And it's all built to bring you closer to the drivers you love and the action you crave. For more on automotive technology, keep it here at NASCAR.com.